Former UFC heavyweight champion Francis Ngannou is free to pursue boxing mega fights against the likes of Tyson Fury, despite recently joining MMA promotion, the Professional Fighters League. The 36-year-old had been in demand, a free agent, after failing to agree a new contract with UFC. He signed with the PFL earlier this month. Their co-founder, Don Davis, has been speaking to Al Jazeera's Sohel Malik and confirmed that Ngannou is free to box and explained how the Cameroonians' move could be a game-changer for mixed martial arts. We listened to what Francis wanted, and we created a custom deal for him. As a fast-growing creative company, the Professional Fighters League is not one-size-fits-all. We don't do things just our way. We listen to the fighters, what they want to achieve, and create a deal for them. So if I can just get a confirmation from you, you're saying that Francis, despite his contract with PFL, will be able to pursue matches in boxing. Not only can I confirm that, he will do that. He's exclusive to PFL and MMA, but he is free to box, and he will box in a big way in 2023. We think empowering the fighters is good for the professional fighters league. So as they raise their profile, that's good for us. So we'd like to bring Francis to the Mideast in 2024. And we're here in Qatar, and we're also in other countries in the Mideast talking about staging his first pay-per-view fight back in two years in the Mideast. Obviously, the UFC, a big, big name in the sport. How confident are you that you can rival the UFC as the number one brand in mixed martial arts? Remember, MMA is growing. 600 million fans, but that fan base is doubling every seven years. There's only 300 million fans seven years ago. There is room for more than one leader in the sport. So it's not us versus them. It's win, win, win. And I keep saying that over and over again. What we did last week was fighters win because they have another option, not just UFC, and fans win because they have another option, not just UFC. I wanted to do MMA. Jake Paul joined us a couple months ago, the global sensation and crossover. So when you look out to 2024, our first two pay-per-view events, Francis and Jake headlining those, what more could an MMA fan want?